At Northwest Housing Alternatives, we operate the Annie Ross House Family Shelter, um, which is directly across the street from Milwaukee High School. Um, we've had an amazing relationship with the school and the students since 1986. You know, the families with children that we serve are the kind of face of suburban poverty and suburban homelessness. When you get out to um, the suburbs, it is really families with children. Um, so they really appreciate the services. They represent us at First Friday events in the city of Milwaukee. Um, they come out and help us organize food in our food storage area. They're really an amazing volunteer resource. When we need them, they're there. And for our families, when they see kids coming over and participating and working towards their success, it starts to make families feel really empowered. When they see kids especially, young adults who are going over there to put in work to help them succeed, it makes them feel like the community cares about them. And it makes them feel like the community wants them to succeed. Checking all the cans that they already have for expiration dates and tossing out everything that's, out, uh, that's expired. And organized. organized. So Annie Ross House uh, and North Coast Housing serves an area that's the size of the state of Delaware. And they're the only shelter that keeps families together. It doesn't separate like the men and the women. So we just really connected with uh, the goals that we have for this community and they're right across the street so it's like, well, it's just like working with your neighbor really and we just really think it's important to uh, volunteer in a place that you call home. It's a great thing to see in people's eyes how much they really really do respect you and can't thank you enough for what you've given whether it's time, money, presence or simply just saying Merry Christmas to them. It's, it's definitely something very, very special that I've never experienced before. My main goal is to help people. I actually want to become a nurse and I just have a really big passion for helping people. So any little thing that I can do, it just makes me happy. It's just my passion. I think it's just a really big accomplishment. I mean, we help a lot of people and it's so nice being recognized for it. I mean, it's just something we've always had a goal for is to help people and if we get a knowledge for it, that's just great. And so they're on an adult playing field, which is another thing I love about it. It's like, let's get on to the real world playing field and not pretend and do everything real and tangible. And so they get a chance to do that. So, and as we go out, um, I work with my kids all the time about understanding that they're representing our school, they're representing themselves, they're representing the community at large. And probably for me the most important thing is they're teenagers and they carry a, a bigger weight. And because a lot of people make decisions about teenagers, the misdirect when you see one of my kids is, no, this kid's busting it and getting good grades and they volunteer their time and they go help people and they're willing to do whatever, whenever, on the mere notion that they can, which sets them apart and that's a really good message for the community to see, because there's hope. Any time that the adult community can recognize that, that the youth has, has value and worth on an even playing field, count me in, I'm in. But the thing that's really cool about this is to watch the kids. You make a difference. You guys make a difference. That's why we're here.